up, freak bitches, wherever you may be, however you may be watching. Thank you for giving me just a couple minutes of your time. Woke up today to a bit of a surprise from Marvel. You can see it right there. We got a trailer for the new Black Widow movie. Let's take a look at this and break a little bit of it down, shall we? I used to have nothing. This is some uh, flashback a little bit. And then here. I got this job. This family. But nothing lasts forever. I heard you had to leave in a hurry. It's never easy these days. Get a little so bit of young you and that you Ross right there. I've lived a lot of lives, but I'm done running from my past. I know you're out there. I know you know I'm out here. So we're we gonna talk like grown-ups? Is that what we are? See you too, sis. What brings you home? We have unfinished business. We have to go back to where it all started. Lucky us. One thing's for sure. It's gonna be a hell of a reunion. There's David Harbour. Still fits. Family. Back together again. You got fat. trailer for Black Widow. I am really intrigued. A couple of things that I noticed about the trailer. Uh, I've actually read that it takes place immediately after the events of Civil War. So she's on the run from what happened in Civil War and she's that takes her into the events of this film. Also I've noticed, you know, Marvel sticks with the themes for their individual movies. Uh, you know, Captain America was like the... The first one was like a period piece about World War II, but then everything after that was a spy thriller, espionage thing. Uh, Ant-Man was the heist movie, and so on, so on, so on. They made this look very Bourne-esque. It looks like she's a Jason Bourne-type character, which I dig. I'm totally into that, because that's what she is, really, is she is just the female version of Jason Bourne, probably a little more badass, in my opinion, although I love the Bourne movies. Um, really intrigued in what I'm seeing, uh... I love David Harbour and uh, Stranger Things, obviously, but it's interesting to see him in this. Uh, I forget the name of the character that he plays. It's something from the comic books. It's supposed to be like the Russian answer to Captain America, although I don't believe he's genetically enhanced. Uh, really a lot of cool things. So the Taskmaster, he was the one that was standing up outside the uh, that uh, armored personnel carrier with the bow and arrow. Uh, no, that is not Hawkeye. Because that was, initially that was one of my first responses. I was like, wait a minute, is that Hawkeye? No, it's not Hawkeye. That's Taskmaster. Uh, we're going to get a big, big view of what life was like for her before joining S.H.I.E.L.D. and becoming a part of the Avengers. That's really interesting. Uh, all around, a pretty cool trailer. I had no idea that, that trailer was dropping today, so I was pleasantly surprised when I got up and saw that alert on my phone about a new trailer. Watched it immediately before my feet even hit the floor. Came back out to my big screen, watched it on there a couple of times. Really dug it. It's really cool. I'm really interested in seeing where this movie goes. I was kind of not... Hell bent. I didn't. I didn't really need this movie. I didn't want to see it necessarily. Want to see it? I didn't need it to do anything for the MCU. But I am happy to see it because I do like the character and I think it's pretty cool that she's getting her own movie. I'm gonna go see it. So and I hope you guys will too. Anyway, go down in the comments below. Let me know what you guys think about this. We'll see you guys later.